Welcome back to this brand new build, everyone. And look at what we're doing today. started as usual gotta check the trees make sure there's nothing missing okay oh that there was that there was there okay and that's the two guys that were there okay that's accounted for it's okay all right mm -hmm. okay Good. So I got the decals. Okay. The other thing is that I uh, had paints that came with the model. Looks good. Okay, so it looks like got to clean the plastic off because uh, there's like finishing oils on there. So we're going to wash that all off. Okay. Pretty straightforward. I'm going to be adding some lighting to this model. <clears throat> like when I get the, the decals in place here on the boards, I'm going to use some fiber optic lighting in there to light them up. Not everything is going to get lit because a lot of it was just dark switches and stuff like that. So maybe like uh, small areas in here. We'll get lit up back there will be lit up like these small little round circles on here will get lit up uh, i'm gonna have to look at some photos online of the interior cockpit of the apollo craft um just to see which areas in here are actually lit compared to areas well, obviously, where they're not. As you can see here, there are clear sections that you can see directly in. Uh, so you can see, like, the internal workings of the ship and everything. So, um, like on the photo here. Which is looking to be pretty cool. Alright, going to prime everything here.
And there we go. Just gotta let all this set now. Now I'm thinking I'm gonna leave this main body, this color here. Uh, this is a, a silver color in the front. So uh, I'm gonna use my chrome silver for that. Chrome silver on the inside as well. Um, it's just gonna be LED lighting, maybe a couple little lights inside there for uh, like um, internal lighting for the cockpit. Um, Actually, on the inside here, uh, I'm going to chrome silver it, and over top of that, once it sets, I'm going to have a green color because the paneling was all uh, a green, a light green color. <clears throat> so, I'm going to do that. Uh, like uh, this paneling here. gotta cover this anyway um, I'm gonna make that all light green for those and the astronauts are gonna be white for their suits so anyway let's get this done first Yeah, I got the more painting done here and I just lightly uh, silvered the outer skin here just so it has that look to it it's not as chromey as that and I got to mask this off once it's dried and that'll be matte black it's looking good though not bad and the stand here was supposed to be white, but I'm making it chrome silver just so it kind of goes with the rest of the ship. Not bad. Okay, so we got everything there looking good. I'm just going to put this to the side for now. And we got uh, this here. I'm going to mask this off so I can get the proper co uh, color on this part of the the bell and I'm gonna mask this side off after to get the uh, matte black on that part of the bell So this is like a dark gray on uh, this part of the bell. All right, so I got those ready to go to be installed in the panels.
Okay, so I've been busy getting the uh, painting done on all of these parts here. Coming along quite nicely. Got it almost done now. And then we can start working on assembly. Okay, now that everything's all painted up, we're going to start getting these little pieces in here. These are the uh, thruster quads that go in here. There's little notch, a small one, a large one, a small one. These ones here go in the small areas, and this one here goes in the long one. And we got these that go in these areas right here. this which goes along the front here and you'll see where the ridges are in here that's where they go We got these three panels here that get connected. This section here goes right in there. Okay, so I got all the structure here with the seats. I gotta go all together now. These little holes there, the pins on these, uh, there's an upper hole and a lower holes. The two side seats go in the upper holes. The center seat goes into the lower ones.
Oh, I see. No, it, uh, the pins on the outer seats are wider apart, so they're uh, able to still connect together. here. All right, so I'm going to get this panel onto there and then it goes into there after I get those guys installed. Time to get these guys in there. Areas here. This is all for the, uh, the docking assist. Got these two little clear pieces that have to go in here.
All right, time to get that on there. And then we can get this clear piece on there. And get it all on there. That's it for this episode, everyone. In the next one, we're going to be working on this half of the command module.